Hi, my name is Richard Bilderbeek and I'm going to show you how to use this branching model with master, develop and a topic branch or a feature branch, in this case named branch, um, to get things from your feature branch or your topic branch to develop using a pull request. Um, this follows this branching model from Michiel Driessen, or whatever that is his name, Vincent Driessen. Um, we're just going to do this using git command line um, and GitHub. So the GitHub repository I'll be using is called the Programming Formalisms Project 2023. Uh, my name is Richard Bilderbeek, so there's a branch called Richel here, you can find it. And I'll be adding some trivial text to Richel, made a, and then make a pull request to develop, asking for a code review. So let's get this thing cloned. CD up, git clone. There it is. Wait till done cloning. CD programming formalisms project 2003. I'm gonna go to my branch, and now I'm gonna make a trivial change. I'm gonna delete this white space. Git add. I'm gonna push it. Uh, removed. Useless. White space. And I'm going to push it so that it's on the Richel branch, which is a topic or feature branch. Let's take a look if, we, if it's in there. Oh, it already shows there at the top. There. Let's double check by going to Richel. And here we can see that it's on GitHub now. Now, let's say I want to get this code merged to develop. Then you click here, compare and pull request. And here I'm going to compare Richel to develop. Develop is the branch where you merge that code. And um, this is the text. Uh, you'll find, and then uh, we're going to call it create pull request. So what we can do now is, uh, is, is so this is the complete pull request with all the files and commits. If all files change, all the commits. I did one commit and one file, so there's, there's not much. Uh, checks are running, so if you have continuous integration turned on, um, and this repository has many, you'll see them run. And um, now I can add stuff like, hey, could you please uh, review this? Um, I removed a useless white space. Go ahead and criticize that. Because you'll uh, you'll be asking for a code review. Um, they're either they're either assigned. You're not allowed to do it yourself. This is also common practice to let someone else do it. I can ask a reviewer here, uh, assign someone for reviewer. Um, so this is where the life of Richard Bilderbeek uh, ends. He's now has he has now he now has to wait until someone else reviews this. Um, because all tests are passed, he can be rather certain if the people agree or disagree with him that it will be added. It's just a white space. No one is going to really criticize that. If you are the reviewer now, uh, you can do this here. You can like review changes here. You, it's a lot of looking and clicking, but not very complex. And then you merge, click on merge pull request if done. Or something like, good job. Good job, I will happily accept, happily accept. <coughs> Comment, merge pull request, confirm merge. And now the work that was put on the Richel branch is now on the develop branch. Let's double check. Here develop has recent pushes, Le less than a minute ago. So here we can find the merge of the pull request from Richel to develop. So this is uh, the way how you get code from your feature branch to develop using a code review uh, using this branching model. So note that I never use master uh, because, well, that was not the purpose of this video. There are, can be different rules when to do these. I have seen teams when develop passes, you always merge it to master. Um, like develops like a pre-check for master. 
Uh, we're going to end this video now. I wish you a very good day. Bye.